Bonjour tout le monde. Aujourd'hui c'est vendredi le 18 novembre. Le mot de passe, ça dépend. Um, Aujourd'hui dans l'histoire. Aujourd'hui c'est vendredi le 17 novembre. Savez-vous, do you know, les Français ne fêtent pas Thanksgiving. Les Français ne fêtent pas don't celebrate Thanksgiving. Mais Thanksgiving existe au Canada. Mais th le Thanksgiving au Canada est différent que le Thanksgiving aux États-Unis in the U.S. Um, Thanksgiving au Canada est le 9, ou était, was le 9 novembre en 2023. Et normalement, Il y a un grand dîner avec des plats similaires à ceux qu'on mange pendant Thanksgiving aux États-Unis. Okay, let's unpack that. Il y a un grand dîner avec des plats, dishes, similaires à ceux qu'on mange. Those which one eats, mange, pendant Thanksgiving, during Thanksgiving, aux États-Unis, in the U.S. Et il y a toujours un match de football canadien. Le football canadien, as far as I know, is just like football in the U.S. Maybe there are some different rules, but it's not soccer. It's actually football like American football. Uh, il y a toujours un match de football canadien à regarder. Donc, manger et regarder un match de football sont des traditions. Now, I have heard that Thanksgiving in Canada is not nearly as big a deal um, in Canada as it is in the U.S. It's not usually something people like travel to see family for. It's more of a just a day off, an excuse to have a nice meal. Um, but it's not quite the to-do that it is here in the U.S. Okay. Quelle était la date de Thanksgiving au Canada en 2023? En français, s'il vous plaît. Quelle était la date en français de Thanksgiving au Canada en 2023? Et, what is one way in which Canadians celebrate Thanksgiving? Uh, that you can answer en anglais ou en français. Okay. Ensuite, quick rights. Pour cette semaine, this week we have a new prompt, um, and my suggestion is to tell a story. You can use il y a, il a, elle a, elle aime, il aime, il est, elle est, il habite, elle habite. Make up a new character and tell me some stuff about that character. Um, encore une fois, deux minutes. Um, that time is down here. So deux minutes at a timer. A écrivé, just write as much as you can. Um, there was some confusion about this last week. You do not need to submit anything. I just want you to have all of these in your cahier, in your quick write section, and I want you to make sure that you um, have them ready to go to take some pictures of them and upload them to a document when I have you do that at the end of this quarter, which will be around Christmas break. Okay, weekly check-in, as I tell you every week. It's always good to hear from you. I usually hear from maybe two of you. <laughs> um, so if I could hear from more, that would be awesome. Merci. Uh, that, of course, is the button at the top of your Schoology page. Let me see. Weekly check-in. Le bouton vert. Okay, a... Last couple of things, TPR et la chanson. So at this point, you are responsible for knowing those numbers up to 70. So use the Quizlet, use the song, um, know those numbers. You will have a quiz on those um, a little bit later. I can't remember if it's next month. It might be next month. It's soon-ish. Um, so just keep on top of those. Uh, TPR, we've been practicing those same TPR moves for a little while now. But again, they're there for you if you want to get some more practice. Okay, say two. We have a short week next week. We will be doing a couple little assignments, but nothing major. Um, so be looking for those next week. Merci. Au revoir. Bon weekend.